something, right. or stand in the door actually and hold it open, that would be a good idea. And then as I've got the box, I sort of go like that. Like that sort of thing. Yeah, something like that. And then when it's when I've completed it and moved out of the shot, you can cut it. I've always liked psychological thrillers. There's just something about them where you, you know, you just effectively have this storytelling playground, if you will. In terms of uh, the actual script for Memo, the story itself I wrote on a few on a few bits of paper during my lunch break at six forms. So this must be three, four years ago now. Um, the rough, the rough idea, if you will, was probably three maybe four pages long, uh, at the very least. <laughs> when it came to actually making a uh, memo, it, realistically the film was quite easy on paper to make. You know, it wouldn't require a lot of extensive planning, a lot of extensive budgets, and this and the other, because it would require just a good few locations and such. Filming the piece, you know, it just came together, you know, perfectly. Um, a lot of the crew from my previous project came together. It was like a big family, more or less. You know, we all just um, all came back together. I put the call out and said, you know, this is the project we're thinking of doing, and would you be interested? Overall, it was a very enjoyable experience. Um, you know, it was, as I say, a team effort. You know, it, was, it wasn't my picture; it was our picture. You know, it was a film. We all contributed in some way, we all did something to help out with the narrative and the concepts and what have you. It was a really, really enjoyable experience. Um, you know, everyone who was involved, even the people who just stood there and held props, um, you know, without them none of it could have happened. So, really, really am um, uh, grateful for the help and the enthusiasm. And, um, yeah, certainly interested to see uh, where this film goes because as I as I speak, it's been received quite well by uh, quite a few people. Um, and yeah, it's uh, it's it's interesting to see where where it goes next.